Thank you. New at 6, tis the season to look before you dive in. Boaters and beachgoers are reporting an invasion of stinging critters up and down our coast. News Channel 5's Jamel Lene is live in Lake Worth with the return of the moon jellyfish. Jamel. Well, people are enjoying their Columbus Day here at Lake Worth Beach. As you can see, a lot of the people are in the water. The blue, excuse me, the purple and the yellow flags, they were up earlier and for a good reason. That's because there's jellyfish lurking in between the waves, ready to sting people. There could be jellyfish riding these waves as they crash along the beaches in Lake Worth. I had no idea that the jellyfish were in bloom today. Some beachgoers won't get in for that reason. That kind of freaked me out a little bit. <laughs> I've been walking up and down the beach taking pictures of them. Palm Beach County lifeguards have put out the yellow and purple flags, warning beachgoers to be cautious. Lieutenant Alan McQueen says a growing number of pink moon and man o' war jellyfish are being pushed closer to shore because of the strong waves. If you're in the water, you're going to get stung today, basically. He says some stings can send people to the hospital. I go in and get stung every day. Uh, they don't bother me personally, but uh, if you're a senior and or a, a child uh, and or you're sensitive to them, they can light you up pretty good. A risk that's not worth getting back in the water for. I was only in there for a little bit today, but um, yeah, I'm, I don't particularly want to get stung by jellyfish, and I hear those are pretty bad. Definitely check the advisories before I get in the water again. So lifeguards telling me here that yesterday several people were stung by jellyfish. Um, they were treated here, and they say most of these things can be treated with vinegar. That's the latest here at Lake Worth. Jamel and A, WPTV News Channel 5.